Welcome back, like crazy cool people. This is Game Edge, and we are back in the forest. Yes, a hiatus, a little bit, a little bit of uh, turmoil. I guess you can say my own life. We had a little bit of uh, emergency, as we'd say. So yeah, I love one in the hospital. So I'm so sorry, guys. I know some of you were very disappointed that there wasn't that many forests last week, and I, I really do apologize. I tried my best to get a lot done, but I also want to make sure I build this without having any kind of uh, sidetrack, as you could say. That's that's what we'll go with sidetracking. Um, yeah, that's the way it is. So sorry about that. I apologize. I hope you guys are still into this. Uh, I know there's December 14th coming up, and I hope you guys are still understanding we're still building this baby. Yes, we are. Uh, there's still a lot of work to be done, and as you can see, there's a lot of coolness left to be done. <laughs> there's still a lot of coolness. There's still a lot of work to be done here. Oh, my God. Anyways, yeah, this is a thing, so we're actually getting it done as much as possible. I've actually done a lot of uh, work on the side. Trying to make sure we're ready for uh, getting this built. And again, it's it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. I won't deny it. It's, this is the biggest build. It's probably enough for about five builders at once. And uh, yeah, well, it is what it is. Let's get it done. Let's get this done. So yeah, as you can see right now, I am using uh, the M131. I think it is M131. What is it called again? Let's do this again. If you guys ever do this tonight, M131. That's it, yeah. So setting on the bottom here, M131. Uh, some of my settings here are a little lower than usual, as you can see. I, I've actually lowered them because we had a little bit of problems at one point. But also on multiplayer, there seems to be a little bit of an issue. So I just kept them the way it is. And it hasn't really affected the quality of the game. So if you look at them, pause it, check it out. Uh, they seem to work well. I, Ultra is really good. I used to play it Ultra all the time. Uh, but again, it had a little bit of issues for the multiplayer. So that's it. Let's just get this all built. Look how fun we can get this all. I should have enough. Super quick, huh? <laughs> so much fun. This game is a blast. Don't get me wrong. I still love it. And I know a lot of you were disappointed. And I get it. I'm so sorry. I Sometimes family, you know... Uh, you, not sometimes family has got to come first and we got to take care of each other and um yeah when you're, when you're in the hospital and you're near uh death and all that that's the way it goes oh shit that i did not want to do luckily enough i'm not building this uh, floor here it's gonna be more of a storage area so we're gonna get some of that done i don't know where that went that that looked like it just disappeared that could be anywhere around the world at the current time so we will find it one day i'm sure we'll find it it's uh Oh, it fell down there. Good. I seen it fly away. That's why I'm like, it could be good. That could be a thing. That could be a goner. That could be a goner for a life. But yeah, that's the way life goes. We're going to have to get ourselves built here. And we're going to get ourselves ready for December 14th. And also for the multiplayer, um, as you can see, there's a little bit of uh, issues and stuff. We had a little bit of issues during the week. Uh, that's not over with yet. We are still going to keep that maybe a little hiatus until December 14th coming out. Because I'll be honest with you, the views are not as high as I, we would like on them and we'd like it to be December 14th. It seems like everybody is waiting for that. That's what I've only received uh, info back from you guys is December 14th. So I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to hold anything back and pretend things you know, are uh, are going to continue the way they are, but they're going to continue. We're going to try our best to get out as many force as possible. Uh, I love this game. As I told you, I've been this is my my baby. I mean, I, I've been building with this for such a long time and I love this game beyond belief. Uh, as you know, this will never change for me. Uh, this game is the love of my life. Now, am I disappointed that the developers didn't add things for 182 uh, before they left for a month for the story? Yes, I am kind of a little bit disappointed that they didn't give uh, some kind of candy for a month that hiated us to building their story. Now, am I excited for this story? I am super excited for that story. And I won't deny it to you guys, I, I won't... Uh, I won't sit here and say that I'm, I think it's over with. I think that the game is about to explode. So yeah, there's still a lot, uh, the story wise and getting it done. Now, do I hope a lot of things, I hope they wake up for the mods. Um, and I hope the developers are listening to this and understanding that the mods, modders, uh, allowing them to come in here and building is a must. You need to give some kind of API or whatever it is that you need to do to let the modders get themselves rolling. Um, it's a must. That's all there is to it. I'm sorry to say it. it's a must. Um, the modders should have a chance to build up your game. Now, if you're going to wait until after the story, at least release it after the story is out and we get everything rolling, uh, mods will be allowed to, to be added to this game. Now, that'd be really cool. Uh, I'm not talking about cheating mods. I'm talking about mods like, you know, different kind of things, adding store, uh, you know, other kind of chairs or designs or, you know, different kind of textures and stuff. It's possibilities are endless with modders. Modders are a key to a community. Uh, so if you look at Some Days to Die, that's, you know, done very well. And even if I don't play them, the Val mod, it gives an opportunity to gamers to play what they want to. And I would be very curious to play that. Um, if they modded, if they allow us to mod uh, the forest, I would be into it. 
legally mods it would be very very cool all right so this room is done a little bit of a gap there that's interesting mm. it's okay we'll take care of that afterwards uh we're gonna put some storage here too up here we're gonna bring some sticks in there's a stick log sled out there a little cold oh. hungry dry get fire can't handle it you're fine chill brother chill you can do us yeah, we'll just get all we can out of these. We'll shoot the sleds down here on the bottom. We'll pick those up afterwards. Don't have to do each and every one of them. As you can see, we're building out a little different. This is going to be a different way of building. I'm keeping that tree going out. From what I'm, I'm reading, because I went back to read, and I went to find out if it's possible for us to cut another hole, because remember I told you I had to cut 20-plus holes over here uh, because to cut that properly. And I, I, miss, I, I may have you know, screwed up a little bit here or there. But I'm wondering if I could cut a hole here. This is where I like to put the stairs going up, up here. So that would be the key. If I could do that, it'd be awesome. I haven't tested it out yet, so we're going to be doing this you know, on video. So my disappointment would probably be there if it doesn't work. But from what I'm reading, it should let me cut another hole. It's per floor. So per floor. So let's rotate this. And we're going to put the right about here. Now I see it's actually telling me there's a problem with the wall there. That's okay. Yes, it does work. Beautiful. All right. Very happy right now. Let's put... Uh, there we go. We're going to put some stairs going up here. Ooh, that didn't cut right at all. All right, we'll do one more cut. Try to even that off. That's nice. That's better. Because I don't like it when it's all stingy and crappy. We're going to do some custom stairs all the way down here. Uh, really easy now. I mean, they're easier than they used to be. They really are. But they also can have some little bit of problems. I like to start from the top to the bottom. I know some of you are the contrary. But we all have our ways. I just, I like to know where the, uh, this is even or not. Right here. There we go. There we go. And I have to make it that crazy. I just want to bring all the bring log sleds up, so I'm trying to make it as smooth as possible. Looks like we're gonna need another cut right here. Maybe even widening it out a little bit too. Looks like it's a little bit, a little narrow. Rotate you to be narrow a bit. Maybe okay. Might just be enough to fit the log slab there. Again, we're not looking for perfection. Oh, I can't fit through this fucking door. That's right. I should have made the steps over here too. Anyways, we'll make someone on each side. It's not a big deal. Oh, that's just irritating. Slightly irritating. Jump off with it. Oh, we need to eat. Holy crap. Do we ever need to eat? All right, so I have some food up here. Man, are they irritating that sound? That sound's coming from the hills over there. Um, I hear it over there, and then there, I think it's from the hills on the left-hand side. That's what at least I'm, it sounds like. Do we know what it is? I used to think it's a deer, but now I'm starting to think it's something else. A little creepier. <laughs> it might just be. Might just be. Now, I do put these all nice and prim, but afterwards, uh, the deers will come around and screw it up. So it's okay. They'll screw it up for us. Uh, we need food, so we're going to bring this down here. We'll stop near the food rack. Then we'll get out of this uh, M131 setting for daylight because I don't like it during the day. Okay, this is bad food. That's uh, not good food either. We have one that's... Uh, all right, that's that was half decent. That actually brought us up back up. All right, that's good. Um, I'm going to take a little piece of aloe just in case that's food. <laughs> Makes us sick. Just in case. All right, we'll bring the sticks up here too because we're going to need to put some storage. And we're also going to need to put out the other stuff here. So we'll get... Uh, we'll bring up all the logs we can. We'll try to get this roof done here. I'd like to get the ceiling done. The roof, the ceiling done on this base. There's still more to go. A lot more building left to go. Do a lot of storage room this. So we're going to place this over here for now. Uh, we're going to put some racks for oops, for skins and stuff in here. Just 
because it's irritating to carry. And I know I drop them when I'm catching the deers and stuff, but it's really irritating to have so much skin and not be able to um, not be able to do anything with this. So we're actually going to put a skin rack up here, and we're also going to be doing a couple other things here. Skin rack right here. Uh, it's more like our storage base. We can put it right about. Let's put it against this wall here. Uh, maybe I'll put in those. No, I'm gonna put it on here. So we're not gonna use this as a log sled route. We might as well just when we walk in, so it's nice, and easy to get. I should have some sticks on me, of course. Oh, that's beautiful. All right, so let's drop this. There we go. Some lizard skin. Oop, and a rabbit. Beautiful. We more skins. We do not have any more. That's good. So we'll storage. We'll put a little storage of this if we can around here. At least we're gonna have tons of that. And looks like the sticks not as needed as I thought they would. Probably gonna need logs more than anything else. But we'll we'll get around to that. Don't worry. We'll get around to having lots of stuff uh, done. All right. Let's get this over here. That's fun. That is actually a glitch that's been going around for a long time. It's a well-known one that keeps on hopping up to the top roof. Uh, top of the ceiling, sorry, whatever it is you want to call it. Some people make this into a roof, that's why I call it that. I've done it before, but this is far from over. We still want to go up a little higher, and I'm building all around this tree. So this tree came back at one point when the developers brought back all the trees, and, I don't know, just decided to keep one in the middle of the build. And, yeah, we're going up way up top there. We're going to be building really high. All right, let's flip this around here. Turn you around. Actually, not so bad with M131. Let's see the differences. It's not a whole lot of big differences in the daytime. I don't think it's that big of a difference. All right, so be it. I just want to be able to knock down as many trees as I can because uh, regrow mode, when I go to bed at night, they grow back. So the important part is making sure the trees here, especially the ones you can see around us uh, here, I like them to grow back and that way I can chop down wood and at least get a couple log sleds out. Uh, put your lighter away, brother. And it works out really well. Now, I find that there's one thing they did change quite a bit, the lighting, the gamma, uh, those kind of things. I find it's a little bit annoying. It's a little bit too bright for me. I know it's a fog and those kind of things. I hope they adjust that and work on it. Uh, just like some days to die, all the things, they, they seem to leave that. Now, this game is one of the most beautiful games you will ever, ever get to buy. If you ever get to, if you don't play this and you want to, trust me, it is as much fun as it looks like right now. Um, you know, I don't make money to, to tell you guys that. Uh, I play the game that I like and I, I love, and I played, what, 400? Got to be close to 400 videos of this. I made a lot of them, and I still love it. Still love it. Like I said, it's it's more of anything else. This week was all about family and stuff and issues. And I tried to make it a hardcore mode and this mode. I'm trying to see which ones you guys want. And now this week will probably be the definite to find out which version you guys want to continue the way I'm doing right now. Uh, do you guys want, voice your opinion. Do you guys want to continue doing uh, the hardcore mode? Do you rather just have this mode so we can finish our build? Uh, do you prefer that? That's what you guys have to tell me. Again, the views have to be there. It's not to be mean, but you guys have to be here. <laughs> You guys would be supporting this. You gotta support the forest uh, on the channel, or else if it's getting like way below views, and it's just you know, unfortunately, it's not worth to make. If you guys are not gonna watch it, and I really want to make them. I hope you guys are in behind it too. So, let's just drop you. Now on this hillside, is it quiet? It is absolutely, definitely quiet. Um, I'll be honest with you, I haven't seen any mutants or uh, cannibals on this hillside. I think that's something they're going to have to work on big time because if they, if you're going to bring them back, it's great, but you got to bring them back all over the place. you got to have them attack everywhere. I have to be standing way over there for them to come out and start attacking. I have food out. I should be seeing the hungry ones every freaking day, but I don't. I really don't. Kind of disappointing. Oops. There we go. Let me bring one log sled. That's not so bad. Those tree trees can stay. We've done it quite a bit. All right, let's bring this log sled back in. And again, I still have more logs all across this wall here. So it's not as if we're going to run out. And I'm not holding back from doing it. And yes, that door will be built at one point. But if you think about it, when it opens up, I don't want to have to tilt myself around and crunch myself in. I want to just slide in it out. So 
I put a door there to show you guys what it's going to look like. And uh, afterwards, we'll get it done. Up you go. Oops. We're going to bring it onto the rails here because there's no ceiling, so it won't bother us. It won't pop us up when I grab the log sliver now. Seems like it's more of an enclosed room. I don't think this would actually affect us here. Now this part here is going to be all its own little, its own little thing. Don't worry, there's going to be some stuff there. I got to build that afterwards. It'll be like windows and stuff. You'll see. We gotta get these logs out in place because if not, I'm going to have them all over the place, and it's going to take hours for us to get it out. And I want to get out as many videos as I can for this, so this is very, very important. I kind of need to build a seat out here somewhere. Probably put one on a deck right here on the side. The guys are always exhausted. Um, let's bring up another one. It's a great thing about having logs everywhere here. We can actually just build this baby up. So how are you guys doing? Are you guys still building in the forest? Are you guys still getting involved? Or are you just waiting for December 14th to restart? The question is, are they going to make us restart for the story? I wonder. I wonder if that's going to be something. It's like, we, you know, some people are waiting desperately and they're going to go down and, and open those doors, the real ones, not the ones you're seeing now with the mod API bullshit or the glitch. The real doors. Oh, shit. Well, that was an interesting ride. <laughs> Can you imagine real life, man? They just rubbed his face all the way across that wood. That would hurt. Don't throw me off the building, please. Shit. Okay. We could park some of these in front here. I'll take care of them afterwards. I bring them in and I come back and anyways, I fill them up. It's good to have them on the side here anyways because it just kind of tells me how much logs I need to go pick up. Again, we have more than enough to finish up this roof for now. We now we need, what, 51 logs? Pfft, easy. I know where the rest are, actually. I'm thinking about it. Where are the rest of the logs? 51 logs. That doesn't look like 51 logs left to put. That does not look like that at all. No way. That might be somewhere else. There we go. Just a couple more. Where's the f other logs? I don't understand. I'm trying to think where the hell else I would have put up those logs. They're either been glitched in or hidden somewhere. All the ones here in the front door. That's right. Duh. Game edge, duh. All right, let's bring this over here. And then we're gonna have to go back to the village. Should I need some dynamite uh, for logging. So we're going to head out to that village right after this. Get at least this part done, which is so important. Maybe we'll do a village next. Because I really need really to get this done as fast as I can. Oh, look at that interlinks. Isn't that beautiful? I really want to do a whole build of that one day. When it's a smaller build, that would be amazing. Uh, okay, so that's good. That interlinks. We're done here. So this is the finale of this part. That's good. We're doing good. It looks nice. Um, across here, I want to build something across here, but I was thinking about it. Can I actually just put the walls up? Uh, but then again, I just want... Mm. See, I have two different thought processes of it. I want to gate it up and create kind of like a wall with wood and stuff and brick. I want to, Not brick, uh, stones. Where the hell is that going? Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's going to leave a like, gap. That's not going to work. It's dipping down. Definitely. Oh, it's dipping down from over there. That's what it is. What if I put it from there? Because it's missing a floor. That's what it is. Let's see what it looks like when I just put it out here. Without touching that part, I can put a different column there. All right, well, let's stop you there. Looks pretty straight, and then maybe put another piece of rock all the way across here on the top. Yeah, I think that would work. Yeah, that would probably work perfect. Window, window, window. And then I'll put rock on top of that. Yeah, that's going to look nice. 
that's gonna give us some kind of little as little 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 kind of closure part this part here this part here is gonna annoy me we can actually do something on each side of that so I have to play with this a little bit before we go crazy on it that's why I do most of this offline off off camera because it becomes a little bit of a tedious and you're trying to figure out exactly how you're gonna build this and be all proper and make it look nice that's gonna be a hell yeah okay we'll do that afterwards I'll, I'll mess around with that I might change it up that's fine okay so we have oh can you stop that please thank you all right we're also going to need some coverage and stuff because with this new it improved um well plants and stuff they did i'm not sure why they did that i mean it makes sense for hardcore mode it just doesn't make sense for our mode right now for normal mode when you go to normal mode it's it should be just simplistic uh everyday kind of thing you shouldn't have all these you know living hard with the plants and stuff but you can't carry that many rocks all of a sudden you can say i can't carry plants it just doesn't make sense to me why am i hard time finding this there you go we'll put a bed over here so we can sleep put the bed on this side nice and safe should we'll put it in an angle i hate to always think it's perfect there we go and we have cloth that should we need uh rabbits right should have uh might be missing a few let's get the more sticks like i said we're gonna need sticks so we'll get this done now we're missing one rabbit skin and that's it for that one so one rabbit skin missing that's okay and then we're also gonna need Now, it is like a temporary base, so I'm putting that bed there for one reason. It's kind of a day bed. It's a worker bed. They used to have worker beds in these kind of places. I just want it all nice and prim and proper so I can have all the stuff I need uh, in one place. I'm going to put another skin rack, actually, too. I'm thinking about it because I run... I Honestly, I kill enough animals for keeping those food storage all up in par. It's not too close to the stairs, no. There we go. Make a second one. Build we'll collect at least a lot more. I won't have to worry about it. That'd be nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. One last thing. I need to put up this cabinets. Uh, small cabinets. Yeah. Yeah, this is small cabinet, large cabinet. Did he change that up a bit? I haven't built one in a long time. Can you put anything on these? That's right, you can. It's been a little while since I haven't been able to put storage stuff or wanted to. Swing you around, baby. That changes up a little bit. The way these things work, so it should be interesting to see. Come on. I was going to get some logs. Uh, we put a stick storage in here, maybe? Maybe a good idea to put stick storage. Stick holder. Um, actually, put the stick holders in between these walls here. Uh, we're going to do one here. And go up on it and just press R. It'll give you a larger one. That's perfect. Now, I don't know if we'll have enough sticks to put in there, but it's okay. It's a good start. There we go. <laughs> Not enough. We will need to bring out this log sled. That's good. And we're going to get... Oh, shit. Okay. Well, we're going to throw you down here. That should make it. We wouldn't, so we're just going to take the other way down. And of course, I got a couple of lugs left here. That's awesome. Until we do that. Mm. <laughs> can I reach it from here? I can. That's awesome. 
make me build these stairs after all, you sons of bitches. Uh, can I grab it and bring it back? Where's the... Uh... There she is. I'm back up. Yep, so you can use that back and forth. That's something. Okay, we'll drop you here. There we go. Again, a strange building. Absolutely. But it will, it will rectify itself as it goes through. Just like this one here. If I grab this, it's going to do the same thing, isn't it? Son of a bitch. Okay, I'm going to do most of that off camera. I just wanted to test it out. The hell? Did I get taller? Okay. <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. As I'm watching that there, that one is stuck straight down. <laughs> Whatever. It's all good. It's all good. We're going to be fine. Put you over here. And grab another log slide. We should be just enough to put at least get those cabinets done and I'll get the rest done afterwards. So much to do, so little time. And again, are you guys excited about it? Please talk to me. What are you guys doing for your builds? You also could join me on Steam on the group. There's a group on Steam. Uh, I love to see some pictures and a lot. I love some assistance in that because the base building, the, the way it's going, but I'm definitely still addicted to the forest. So please don't take it the wrong way. It just was seriously a very, very hard few weeks. So it's all back to normal for, uh, well, back to normal. It's still dicey, of course, but we'll take day by day. Definitely need a storage rack here, too. For meat. Damn, that's a lot. Count, look at the, the actual, look how this is built, and tell me you actually need that many logs. One whole log for one little shelf. <laughs> Excuse me, but no. Okay, so we got chocolate bars, food. All right, so let's put in um, RX because we we are going to go over there. So let's put C, 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 C. That, that way we can pick up plants and stuff and have backup if we need it. Damn it. You rotate this? I hate when it chooses what you have to put on. Let's take you. There we go. At least it doesn't look so bad. At least that's all placed down. Now we need to make more of this, of course. But at, at least, like I was saying, at least we can actually get, you know, more plants and stuff. Because now it's becoming ridiculous. That's still not enough. We should build store a lot more in this. We'll have to deal with it. Part of life. That took way too many logs for one shelf. Wow. That value was not there for that at all. All right. We're done. We're going to place that out. Let's go and check it to see what we've done so far. Oh, is there any way for me to push it without... Deer can push this thing. Why can't I push it? Oh, I'm jammed in. Shit. Good. It fell off on the other side. Ha <laughs> ha, sucker. So that's good. All right, guys. We'll leave the episode here. Thank you so much for being here. We'll back up at the double check to see what we've done in our work, of course. But uh, again, thank you so much for being here. It looks like there's no attacks. We're definitely going to get ourselves a little bit more involved next because I have to go to our camp. Uh, we're going to have to do a little more, I guess, searching for them. It's unfortunate. I kind of like them coming around. But in, in hardcore mode, I see them all the time. So you guys check it out. Check out the hardcore mode this week. Double check to see what you guys want to do. What what do you guys want to see? You know, you guys want to see the end of this? Do you guys want to see this built? I want to see it built. Uh, but if you guys want to see a brand new season, more voice it. I'd love to see what you guys... Have. Oh, wow, that thing was glitched. I'd love to see what you guys have to talk and what you guys are interested in. So thank you so much for being here. You guys are absolutely, absolutely awesome. That looks beautiful, the sun. All right, let's <laughs> get your game edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.